In this video, we'll balance the net ionic equation for Ni, NO3, 2, plus Na, 2S. This is nickel 2 nitrate. This is sodium sulfide. The first thing we need to do when we balance net ionic equations, we need to balance the molecular equation. This is the molecular equation. It looks like if we put a 2 in front of the sodium nitrate, we'll have two sodiums, we have two sodiums here, then we have two nitrate ions, but we have two nitrate ions here. Everything else is balanced. So this is the balanced molecular equation. Now we need to write the state for each substance. If you know your solubility rules, nitrates, very soluble. So this is going to be aqueous split apart into its ions. Sodium compounds are also very soluble. So we'll put AQ. Sulfides in general are insoluble. Nickel 2 sulfide, that's insoluble. So we're going to write S because it's going to be a solid. These two will react form this solid, which is a precipitate. It'll fall to the bottom of the test tube. So we have our solid and then nitrate, very soluble. So AQ for that. Once we have our states, we can split the strong electrolytes into their ions for the complete ionic equation. Nickel, we don't know the charge on that, but we do know that the whole nitrate ion here is one minus, and we have two of them. So the nickel has to be two plus. So we have the nickel two plus ion, that's the nickel two ion, plus we have two of these nitrate ions, so two NO3 minus. And I'll write the states at the end, let's not do that now. Plus, sodium's in group one, so that's one plus sulfide ion two minus. So two sodium ions, Na plus, and then just the one sulfide ion, S2 minus. These are the reactants in our net ionic equation. For the products, we don't split solids apart in net ionic equations. This is going to be NiS, that nickel 2 sulfide, plus we have a positive and then the negative here for the nitrate, two sodium ions, Na plus, and that two goes to everything here, so we have two nitrate ions as well, NO3 minus. This is the complete ionic equation. Now we can cross out the spectator ions. They're on both sides. If we look at this, we have our reactants and our products. I can see I have two nitrate ions here in the reactants and in the products. Those are spectator ions. We can cross those out. Two sodium ions, two sodium ions, spectator ions. Cross them out. What's left? That's the net ionic equation for NiNO3-2 plus Na2S. I'll clean it up, write the states. We'll have our net ionic equation. And this is the balanced net ionic equation for nickel 2 nitrate plus sodium sulfide. You'll note that charge is conserved. We have a 2 plus, 2 minus. That gives us a net charge of 0. Over here in the products, neutral compound, net charge of 0. And if we count the atoms up, they're balanced as well. This is Dr. B with NiNO3-2 plus Na2S. Thanks for watching.